Alright, hey everybody. Just want to do a quick overview of a couple of things. And that is three separate sites that are great for finding free models you could use in 3ds Max, which then which can then be ported to RSM, which is compatible with the Rogue client. So here's the three sites: TurboSquid, Archive 3D, and 3D Total. And they're very easy to use, and they do supply free models, which is what we're looking at today. So here is TurboSquid. So to do this, you'll need to log in to actually begin downloading things. So make sure you create a, an account first. So just hit, just hit the join button and make an account. And once you do have an account, let's log in. All right. So now that I'm logged in, to begin finding your models, just under the search bar up here, just search whatever. So I'm gonna search for something really generic, and let's look for, I don't know, plane. Just type in plane. See what happens. Okay, so you notice we've it's found quite a bit of models, right? Well, we're not looking to purchase any models, right? So let's change the sort by from best match to lowest prices. And that should find a couple of free things. So there we are. You see free, free, free. So your target is mostly 3DS and uh, OBJ things like that. We'll discuss model compatibility uh, files with 3DS in another tutorial. But this is just going to show you, you know, all the free models you could find. So if you if you don't like this model, just search another one up, and you'll be able to find it. So that's how to use TurboSquid. And if you do like a model, you know, just click it and hit uh, download up here. It's pretty easy. Hit free download, and then uh, you can see I already have a bunch of other models in my inventory, in my yeah, my profile. But that's about it. So what's the next one? Archive 3D. So this one's actually a little bit easier to use because you don't you do not need an account to download stuff. All you need to do is just click a model. As you can see, let's say we wanted a car, just hit car. It tells us that this model utilizes 3DS and a GSM for I guess 3D visualization. But if you like this, click the image right here and it'll say agree to this, blah blah blah, just hit download now, and there you go. It pops right up. It's quite it's quite a big model file, but uh, yeah, it's pretty easy to use too. You can just search your models up here, or if you hit back, just click any of the numbers. If you don't find something you might like, just download that. And finally, the next model site is 3D models. And this is also pretty easy to use, and it's all free models. And it's it's just uh, these categories here. So if you like Star Wars, you can get ships, Tie Fighters, whatever the heck this stuff is. If you like it, it tells you that this is a Max format or 3DS. 3DS preferred. Um, just click that. Hit the, just hit the model. It shows you the, some preview pictures, and then hit proceed. And then you get to choose Max or 3DS. Choose 3DS, and then there you go. You saved it, and that's all it is. If you like it, if you want a different category, just select another category. It's pretty easy to use. So these, so these three sites are the three main sites that I personally use to acquire different models and I recommend these to you guys as well which is why I'm also doing this tutorial and that's about it so uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time